Good morning, Raoul High School. If everyone would please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. First, I want to apologize if you had your computers on about 7.38 for um, a couple of the comments that the kids were making. They were just talking amongst themselves, so we, we do apologize for that. Um, our other announcements, teachers, um, please be sure to keep your kids in the classrooms as much as possible um, in order to eliminate any extra disruptions that may happen in the hallway. So please keep kids, unless it's an emergency, in your, in your classrooms today. Also, um, during lunch, please make sure you go at your designated time. Students, you do have 30 minutes for lunch, so please be sure that um, you're back on time. We had some confusion about that yesterday, so, and I know that you're going at different times this week, but again, please be um, aware of that. Now for our words of wisdom. Have you ever heard the story of the man with no shoes? He was feeling a little sorry for himself, walking through the streets full of self-pity self and anger. Life was so unfair. Why didn't he have shoes like others? The man with no shoes came upon a man who was sitting on a blanket playing a flute. The music was so beautiful that it lifted, his spirits of the, lifted the spirits of the man with no shoes, and he began to dance. Come dance with me, he said to the man sitting on the blanket. The man replied, I can't, brother. I have no feet. That brings me to an old Irish proverb. Be happy with what you have, and you will have plenty to be happy about. With something to think about, this is Mrs. Brendel. Make it a great day or not, that choice is yours. Good, Good morning, morning Ryle. I'm Smitty. And I'm Abby. And, and this, this is, is your morning, morning announcements. announcements. All right, here's your joke, guys. What do road workers use at the North Pole? I'm not sure. Snow cones. <laughs> oh. And here's your announcements. Seniors with a 2.75 or higher GPA interested in attending UK and pursuing athletic training need to check out the awesome opportunity being provided by UK. Go to the guidance website and click on the scholarships page for more information. Want to help PLTW Biomed with scientific research? Participants will spend about 30 minutes after school and be entered into a raffle for a gift card. To learn more about participating, sign up outside of room 234 or find a flyer posted around school. Boys Track will have open workouts Mondays and Wednesdays during the month of December. Track practices start January 7th. See Coach E in room 140 if you have any questions. Interested in changing it up for the second semester? The yearbook staff is looking to add members with skills in writing, design, photography, creativity, and teamwork. Stop by room 125 to pick up an application from Ms. Caldwell. Anyone wanting to play football next season who is unable to attend the meeting, please stop by room 104 to pick up schedules and paperwork. Ski Club, Winter Special Olympics is, having, is happening in January this year. If you're interested in helping out, please stop by room 232 or 234 during first, third, fifth, or sixth period and let Ms. Hutchison know. The Royal Wrestling Team participated in the Southwest Ohio Classic this past weekend. Ryle placed ninth out of 49 teams. Cole Thomas was champion at 106 pounds. Shea Horton, fourth at 120. Cody Foster was seventh at 160. And Noah Duke was fifth at 170. Congrats. And that's, and that's how, how the cookie, cookie crumbles. crumbles. Have, Have a great day, Ryle. Ryle.